Watch me make a book nook. The inside will look like a scene from Chronicles of Narnia. Egg carton bricks. Wow. Painted the bricks and added interior details. A disaster. Bear with me. Certified electrician. Next I painted a small painting. Added some crown molding. Made from old picture frames. The falling water was made of hot glue and my fresh tears. The dawn treader. Finished. Hello tiny book. I recently completed this beautiful book nook for my boyfriend's sister. Of course, I'm really jealous because it's cute as fuck, so I'm gonna make myself one. So I got this set off Etsy, and it all comes in little pieces that you have to glue together, and then eventually paint it. I think it took me around 12 hours to do. I literally did it in one sitting as well. Am I better than everyone? I don't know why I did this in pen, do it in black paint, obviously. Do I still drink my tea after accidentally dipping my paintbrush into it? Um, yeah, I'm not wasting the Yorkshire tea bag, thank you. So now I'm just adding all the little details to make it look authentic, I guess. This was the hardest bit, I need better brushes, to be honest. Now, I know it doesn't look exactly like Nocturne Alley, but I put my own little creative flair onto it. Painting this was honestly so therapeutic. Just adding a few more little details. And then I accidentally added the shop signage the wrong way and it said Burks and Borgen. And I nearly didn't notice, so that would have been embarrassing, wouldn't it? Then I thought I'd make some polymer clay bits and bobs to put in the windows and on the floor. And then judging by my severe backache, it's done. I really hope you like it. I think it was worth the 12 hours it took. Here it is, all snug on my bookshelf.
seriously, just stop. For the love of God, just stop. You think it's cool, it's not, just stop. Dude, I can't believe I have to say this, but seriously, just, just stop. Into the thick of it. Uh, into the thick of it. 